Good morning, Gulf Shores High School. Will you please stand for your Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. Please remain standing for your moment of silence. Okay, Baldwin County Public Schools will dismiss at noon October 5th, which is this Friday. There will be an FEC meeting on Wednesday, October 3rd during both breaks in room 104. Please pick up an application in Coach Parrish's room and bring it completed with $10 dues. Juniors need to turn in all candy money to Miss Thompson in room 209 by next Friday, or this Friday. We will still have around 100 boxes to sell. The money is needed to have a successful prom. Please see Miss Thompson to grab another box. Any senior who would like to sell candy can grab a box also. Students can purchase a yearbook from Miss Sarah for $75, or they can access yearbookordercenter.com with the order numbers 1798. Don't forget the Seacoast Boy to purchase your laptop skin, only $25 for protection of your laptop. Please don't walk in the hallways with your laptop out. Remember, Mac in the pack. Senior advertisements for the yearbook will be on sale until October 19th. See Ms. Stewart in room 211 if interested. If you don't have a Mac but plan on getting one in October, please sign up in room 116, the help desk. If you have any, if you have a question or a suggestion for the help desk, you can email it to gshshelpdesk at bcbe.org. There's a boys soccer meeting at 6 p.m. in the cafeteria on Wednesday. Parents and players must attend. Uh, starting today, or yesterday, students may no longer have games or movies on their laptops. These items are taking up valuable memory space and impeding the learning process. Teachers and administrators will be the spot checking laptops to ensure compliance. Anyone caught with these games or movies on their laptop will be subject to administrator action. Seniors in early release and community workforce classes who leave school early each day, please start using the electronic sign out on Moodle form to sign out each day. If you did not get the instruction sheet on Monday, see Ms. Hoffman or pick up one in the library. Starting today, you'll have to sign out using this online form. Any girl interested in playing softball needs to meet in Coach Powell's room in, in the meet Coach Powell in the cafeteria during both breaks tomorrow, which is Wednesday. The ASVAB will be given on Friday in the library. If you have signed up with Ms. Mercer, go by her office this week during break and complete the demographic portion of the test so Friday will be shorter. If you're not on the list, there are a few more spots. See Ms. Mercer. Foreign Language Club meeting next Monday, October 1st during both breaks in Ms. Rubio's room. Old and new members, welcome. Bring t-shirt ideas. Club dues are $10 and are due by next Friday, October 5th. Interact members, current members and new members, please see Please go by Ms. Jones's room in room 200 and pick up an application. On Wednesday, October 10th, the Fellowship of Christian Athletes will be sponsoring Fields of Faith. It will begin at the middle school practice field at 7 o'clock and end around 8.30. It will be a time to represent Christ in our community and our school. If you need more details, please see Chandler Inktren or Coach Hammock. Again, Fields of Faith by FCA at 7 o'clock on the 10th. See you there. There's a volleyball game today. It's home, JV at 4.30 and Varsity at 5.30 against Spanish Fort, so come out and support. Say the second? Yes. For lunch, it's chicken parmesan spaghetti with marinara sauce, uh, a green salad, and Italian vegetables with a yummy roll. Happy birthday to Richard Eddings, John Lopez, Annabeth Bergen, and John White. This has been your morning announcements. I am Callie Weiss. I'm Laura Tate. Have a good day. Go Dolphins.